All right, what is going on, everybody? It's your boy Ora Soy back with another video in the new era. Channel, how we doing? So it's been a minute, man. Um, I'm actually recording this intro after. Well, I'm editing the video right now, but I'm recording it right now because the mic is fucking distorted as shit. So you know, I don't want to rape y'all's ears. Uh, so I'm just recording this right now, man. I haven't uploaded on this shit in a while, so I want to come back. You know what I'm saying? And uh, upload a little video for y'all, man. So in today's video, I'm showing you guys how to make piano starters. Um, I'm sure you've seen it before. A lot of people nowadays have been you know catching on to this little starter wave um and basically all the starter is is really just like an unfinished loop um i'll probably say these things later on in the video because i can't remember what i was saying but um yeah i wanted to come on here and show you guys how to make piano starters i've been itching to make a piano video so this is my opportunity to do so you know what i'm saying but uh yeah, man, I'm not gonna waste any more time. Let's just get straight into the video. Let's go. So I have a piano ready here. All right, so for the first thing that we're gonna wanna do for our starter is we're gonna wanna lay down our bass line. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that real quick. Okay, cool. So now that we have our bass line finished. <laughs> All right, so there you go, man. We finished the bass line. Now from here, what we're gonna do, we're gonna bring this up a little bit. What we're gonna do is we're gonna hit Control A, Shift, Click, and then bring it up. And then we're just gonna lay these out as a uh, chord progression. So we're gonna finish all these chords. And I have a pretty standard routine when I make these, and then I like to bring the middle notes up. Bring these down. Let me bring this up, and then I'm going to bring all the bottom notes down. Just like that. There we go. So I like to highlight the top notes like this. Keep them at the top. And we're going to randomize everything. Strum. Bring them up and turn the piano up and then it's gonna sound like this now this is obviously way too low so i'm gonna bring this up All right, cool. I like that. So yeah, you kind of just want to find uh, whatever key you like the most. And I want to bring these down a little bit more. All right, cool. So now from here, what we're going to do is, so what I used to do is I used to clone these and then put the top notes on another, um, on another, uh, layer. But now I just like kind of throwing them all in one, especially if I'm exporting it out as a MIDI, I just like doing it this way. So yeah. So from here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to start laying down all the top notes, like I said, and, um, yeah, let's get straight to it.
Oh boy, man, it takes a while. But uh, yeah, so I want to talk a little bit about this. So basically, one thing I would recommend, man, if you've been playing, you know, the notes for a while, not really, but like if, if you, you know, are a loop maker and you do piano loops like me, you know, a lot of people do piano loops nowadays. Um, but one thing I would recommend is 100% playing around with your velocities, man. This is so important. I'm serious. This is so, it's very important. Like I would 100% recommend that you do this just because it makes your loops sound way better. Like if everything was like this, bro, and I played it out. Like literally velocities make everything, bro. It does. Like you can see. It makes, it just makes such a big difference. Uh, there's a few things I want to change. Some things don't sound good. I bet I actually like that a lot. All right, so yeah, we're basically done. Um, so really all you need to do is just make sure that this is cut properly. So just cut it there. And then what you could do is you could just basically render this without effects like this. Um, and yeah, you could just really export it like that. That's pretty much it though. You know what I mean? It's just basically lay down a melody and then you can export it file export and then boom you're done but yeah man um i really just wanted to come on here <laughs> and make a piano melody i'll be honest thank you guys so much for watching the video if you did enjoy the video make sure you leave a like on the video subscribe to the new era channel follow me on instagram at proper aura follow new era on instagram at one new era thank you guys so much for watching we're gonna upload soon man we're gonna upload way more but yeah man thank y'all so much and i'll see you guys in the next one peace